Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Caitlin, also known as Curls by the Dozen. Today I will be doing a video using melanin hair care. As you can see, I have freshly washed hair. My hair is about 70% dry and I will be doing a twist out today. The first product I will be using in my hair is the Multi-Use Softening Leave-In Conditioner with Nourishing Biobob Oil, Turnip Root, and Provitamin B5. This is a new leave-in conditioner and today will be my first time trying Melanin Hair Care. It says it is a conditioner like no other, so we'll see. Let's check the consistency of the product. So this is what we have here. It feels pretty lightweight. Already have my hair in a middle part. And it smells like peppermint. It definitely smells like peppermint. But it's a nice, it's a nice scent. It smells like a candy cane. So my first impressions after applying some of the leave-in is that my hair feels really soft. And it is great at penetrating the hair strands. It's not something I put on my hair and I felt like it was just sitting on the top of my hair. It definitely got in there and my hair feels very soft. So that's definitely a plus. In my heart, I already knew that Whitney, also known as Natural 85, would definitely come through with the products. So I'm not surprised that my hair is feeling good already. And I also think the packaging is super cute. I love the light pink, peach color, and the black. It's super cute to me. Yo, look at this hair. Oh my goodness. My hair is super soft and it feels pretty good right now so I am going to section off my hair for my twist and I will be right back. I'm back now and I'm ready to style my hair with the twist elongating style cream with shea butter and natural oils for long lasting definition. So I'm excited to try this product. Let's see. It really doesn't smell like anything at all, to be honest with you. Let's see. Very thick product. Feels like shea butter. Let's see, what's the first ingredient? Water, and the next ingredient is definitely shea butter. So I'm excited to try this out. I have my first section of hair, and I will be applying the butter about this much rub it into my hands still not smelling like really anything but that's fine I'm gonna rub this through apply some more to my ends as you can see I'm not adding water because I would like for my hair to dry it's kind of chilly outside and I don't want to get sick I'm not up for that right now, or ever. I'm gonna take a little bit more of the butter, apply some more to my roots, and a downward motion, begin to twist. I'm going to apply a little bit more of the butter twirl it around and let that be and so this is my first twist my hair feels very moisturized which is always a good thing
Hey everyone, so I'm back. I am done twisting my hair. And as you can see, they look pretty good. And I did 10 twists all over my head. Now I have to go and apply some edge control because I need my edges laid. And then I'll come back tomorrow and show you the final result. Hello everyone, so I'm back again. I'll be using the Melanin Multi-Use Pure Oil Blend with the Baobab Oil, Argan Oil, and Vitamin E. Now I'm back and I've separated all of my twists and fluffed them a bit. I think the hair looks really good. I am definitely satisfied with the result. As I said previously, I did believe that melanin hair care would come through and they sure did. I must say that it took me a while to realize my hair was dry because my hair felt that moisturized before I took my twist out. Um, even before applying the oil, my hair felt fine on its own. I'm sure I could have unraveled the twist and not had any frizz, but I would say the oil definitely did add a nice touch and I do like the smell of it. Overall, I did like all of the products. I would say my favorite product would have to be the leave-in. It's very lightweight, but also great for defining and it was easy for me to work my fingers through my hair. I would say I also enjoyed the twist elongating style cream which kept my hair extremely moisturized and I never had twists that felt this moisturized ever so I think it definitely did a good job with that. And I would have to say for the oil I'm excited to use it again maybe for a hot oil treatment. I might even use it for the lock method. If you don't know what that is, that's leave-in oil cream. Or the LCO method, which is leave-in cream oil. I feel like it would be really great for that. And the oil isn't heavy, it's super lightweight, so it's something that you could apply daily if you wanted to. However, this oil says it can be used as a moisturizer for your body as well. So that's definitely a plus. And the ingredients are super easy to read. The first ingredient in here is sweet almond oil, and that's never a bad thing. Please let me know what you thought about my results and be sure to comment, like, and subscribe.